Grand Rising, just the Chariot Tarot. Plus this reading, so I can read these cards accurately and precisely. Any negative energy sent towards me, send it back 10 times fold. This could be past, present, or future, so take that into consideration. Thank you for choosing me to do your reading. This will be for Leos. Call down the angels to protect me, whoever watches this recording. Okay. Tell them the messages that I need to tell the collective. Tell them what they need to know, not what they want to hear. Someone who was sneaky and deceitful wants to come in and apologize. All right. Also, uh, for some reason, the song, Everybody Ain't Your Friend by Booster kept popping in my head. Everybody ain't your friend. Everybody ain't your partner. With him and MO3. Someone is heartbroken. Could be because a relationship has been laid to rest or friendship. What messages do they need to know? Mm, it's like a lot of stuff need to come out. Okay, we got the Ten of Wands. The judgment. Someone is burdened. Seems like God has called kind of judgment. And... Someone is burdened because judgment has been called on the union. And someone is, is, is continuing to be strong. This king of swords. Seems like they could be stuck and bound. For trying to explore. Seems like someone has left a lot of things behind. A lot of illusions with this seven of cups. Someone's burned by a connection. It seemed like it ended. That's how I'm feeling. Like a connection ended. Uh, someone is looking at things from a different view. They are moving forward with their life. Seems like there's a lot of conflict in the background. You could get a message from someone who's angry or who's toxic and wants to stay connected to you. It seems like it could be about sex. Also, they want to come in and apologize so they can keep you low vibrational. Okay, what other messages do we have? Ten of Pentacles. Someone is moving forward to the Ten of Pentacles. They, they're in solitude and they are being offered new love by the universe. This is good. This is great. Someone chose to look past the illusions and move forward. Someone is making plans to explore more or explore their mind more. Okay. So the person who, I guess, for, for that song, Everybody Ain't Your Friend, you got to be somebody who you used to be friends with that wants to come in and apologize, but it's not genuine. 
Okay. What other messages do we have? You see the strength card came out. So, yes. Any other messages? Someone could be watching you because they want to come towards you with an idea or they want to give you their pinnacle. Could be they want to give you some of their time and energy. And what else, Holy Spirit? What other messages do you, they need to know? Like I said, somebody's watching you with this page of swords. We have the eight of wands to the page of swords, to the king of pentacles, to the hierophant. Okay. Someone wants to talk to you about being committed. Because they're also watching you. They want to talk to you or they're talking about you or they could they could be talking about this king of pentacles who wants to be committed in a committed relationship okay tell me more about this king of pentacles <laughs> page of pentacles told you Someone is not accepting this cup. Or you could have not accepted their cup because of how they treated you, but things are gonna balance out with this temperate. We have justice is here. Page of Wands, you could get news about someone who you used to deal with. Seems like you're out here single or they could be single. Seems like there's been a lot of competition in the past. A lot of conflict. But you're moving forward. Could be to this King of Cups also. And it seems like he's going to give you wish fulfillment. Because you're blocking out everything. Like you and God are blocking out things that don't serve you. You're, you're blocking the negativity out because you want your ace of cups. Someone is coming in fast or you could be going to your goals. You could be passionate about your goals. Also, I'm telling you, someone wants to apologize to you because they feel left out in the cold. Okay, what other messages do we have? You could be in solitude with this hermit card. Okay. Someone is in regret. The person who is in solitude could be in regret because they could have breadcrumbed you. And now you're walking out taking a risk or someone could be in regret that, yeah, you could be also in solitude and in regret because you were breadcrumbed and now you want to take a, a leap of faith Someone could have been tired or needing rest. Or someone could be stuck in their mind. Someone can also be praying for new love. This queen of swords. You could be the type of person who is very logical, strong character, creative, and you're balancing things out. Especially with all these choices that you could have had in the past. You're walking away from those, okay? Yeah, your plan is to move forward. What other messages do we have? Yeah, someone is burdened. Got the two of cups behind a connection, I'm telling you. And they want to come in. 
right, what other messages do we have? Someone was being sneaky and the sneaky and deceitful. But you have transformed. You got the Queen of Cups out here to the King of Swords, to the Strength, to the Four of Wands. That's a union. Hey, hey, the truth is here. I'm telling you. Okay, with this Queen of Cups to the King of Swords, to the Strength. Okay, you could have had love for this King of Swords. But you've dominated your lower self. I'm saying like that. You've gotten to the point where if it isn't love or building in your life, you don't want it. You want a real union with this four of wands. And you've turned your back on anything that, you know, isn't helping. Like, and that's the truth. Some things are hidden. But you're a very beautiful person, and judgment has been called. Any other messages? Any other messages, Holy Spirit? You're walking in victory. You're triumph over anything, any adversities that you have. Someone is burdened though. I keep splitting the cards, keep splitting the deck on that. You could be trying to balance out your emotion or your energy. Okay, any other messages? Any other messages? Thank you. Someone is coming towards you with this Knight of Wands to the Ace of Cups. Either you're passionate about finding new love and happiness and joy that God is gifting you with. With the High Priestess, yeah, you, you know it and you charge it forward. You're very brave. I'm telling you, with the four of wands, it's going to be a union. Queen of Cups to the Ten of Cups. Hmm. To the Fool, okay. I'm telling you, you're going to have a family. If you, are, if you already have a family, it's going to continue to be happy. But you have new prosperity, abundance coming. Got the king of wands. This is someone who's handsome. They could, they're paranoid. You have emperor with the four of pentacles to the hierophant to the four of, four of swords to the seven of swords. Also, we have the six of pentacles that's flipped over in the deck. Okay, this King of Wands could be 
garden guarded because they're bossing up and they're holding on. They could be holding back. Someone is being sneaky and it's like, like they're running off with something. Also with this higher fence. You know, you could know that someone would be sneaky. And that they wouldn't, they were breadcrumbing you. But it seems like someone wants to change now since you have cut them off or left them behind. But you have new abundance coming, new love coming. So I'm telling you, someone wants to talk to you. They want to come in and apologize. I'm telling you. Why do they want to apologize? Why do they want to apologize? You know this. In some form, you know this. If somebody wants to apologize, they could have reached out to you and you uh, ignored them. Why do they want to apologize? Because either your wishes are coming true or you're either wish fulfillment. And I'm telling you, they could be angry that you're not responding to their messages. Yeah, they want a Ten of Pentacles with you. Clarify this Ten of Pentacles. Could have been somebody that they could, yeah. Ooh, okay, yeah. Clarify this Ten of Pentacles. To the Three of Pentacles, to the King of Pentacles, to the Page of Swords, to the Queen of Pentacles. This is a couple. Okay, somebody wants to work with you. They want to come in and reconcile. I'm telling you, somebody wants to come in and reconcile and work things out with you because they want that Ten of Pentacles. And they've been watching you. They could be talking about you. Clarify this King of Pentacles and Ten of Pentacles and Queen of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. Got the devil. Oh, to the Page of Cups, hold oh, to the Five of Pentacles, to the Ace of Pentacles, to the Four of Cups. Okay. Okay. Now, this could be a connection that was very selfish. Someone could have been unfaithful, but they want to apologize because they're vibrating low. And they know that you're their ace of pentacles. They they got an epiphany and they know that, that it was a missed opportunity. Why was it a miss why was it a missed opportunity, Holy Spirit? Because they broke your heart. They could have went somewhere else to have a new beginning, putting you in third party situation. Hey, and that's the truth, okay? And you're moving forward. So whatever this is, whoever this is who has hurt you in the past, I would, honestly, it's up to you, but I would let that go because that's what I've been doing. I've been letting people from the past go, especially if they hurt me. Someone wants you though, and they want you passionately, but huh, the two of pentacles came out. They're not balanced. And it came out in reverse. They're not balanced.
Yeah, and you turned your back on this connection. You turned your back on it. Because it burdened you a lot. And you trying to manifest yourself into the empress. Yeah, it could be someone from your past who did this. Yeah, but you walked away. And, and kudos to you. And now they in regret. Let me show you. You trying to manifest yourself. You, try, you putting in all the work so you can come out as the empress, right? Now, this is somebody from your past. Could be somebody you grew up with or someone you've known for a long time, but you walked away from them because the cups that they give you, they were empty. And now they're in regret. But guess what? You're walking away in victory. And I'm going to end it right there. And I hope this helps. Also, sometimes you just got to let the past be the past. Because some people just want to hold on to you because you bring light in their life and they don't have a lot of light in their life. So whatever you do, make sure you do what's best for you and not for anybody else. And I hope this resonates, but you take what resonates and leave the rest because it could be for somebody else. But thank you for choosing me. I send you nothing but blessings and good energy.